The companies Eurofish, Hadran, Nirsa, Servi Group and Trin Marine are committed for the achievement of the Marine Stewardship Council certification for the efficient fleets. They are working together for a sustainable fishing. According to the Tuna FIP, one of the many activities that we are doing is fat development and test with biodegradable and non-entangling materials in order to minimize the impact on the fishery of sensitive species, such as turtles, sharks and stingrays in the eastern Pacific Ocean. Once NIRS obtained the organic origin and vegetal fiber material, they made nine fats with ropes and cabuya clothes, which are distributed to the companies Eurofish and Hadran, three fats each one, to be tasted in high sea by their ships. Based on the experience of fats placed in the ocean farm concession area, the construction of fats was improved and reinforced. In the structure that is the flooring part and in the hanging part, the tail. In the search of a more resistant water material, we found abaca fiber, also known as manila hemp, which is resistant to salt water. Avaca is cultivated in Ecuador and its fiber is obtained from the sheath of the leaves that surround the abaca plant trunk, a close relative to the banana plant. At the moment, we can only obtain ropes of abaca fibers in the craft level, because we don't have anyone that manufactures with this fiber. We are persuading local people to see if they can manufacture abaca clothes. However, the development of fats with biodegradable material is still in process. Servi Group Company built five fats of one and a half meters wide and two meters long, and Hadran Company built ten fats, two per two meters. All were built with cabuja fiber and will be tested by their vessels. By the way, the size of the fats will depend on the standard of the fishing captain or the storage capacity of the boat.